action continues on. Who will be in that fatal four-way for the Reality of Wrestling Television Championship? We started off with a champion and a successful defense. And now here comes a former champion, the franchise, as he's been called, the Mysterious Q. Q has been a backbone of this organization since 2012. He competed in the main event of Many a Christmas Chaos, the main event of Summer of Champions, one and two, holding this company's highest prize above his head. And now Q looks to walk into yet another Christmas Chaos and become a champion once again. But tonight, he's gonna have to go against the former champ himself. And there comes the lone ranger of the road. A former reality of wrestling television champion. A former Reality of Wrestling champion and one of the longest reigning ever. Here comes Brian Keith. No doubt about it, Brian Keith had a tremendous 2019 and 2020 holding that Reality of Wrestling championship for a very, very long time and defending it against some of the best that this company has ever had to offer. And Brian Keith looks to get back on the horse, if you will and go out there and find himself in a fatal four-way match for the Reality Wrestling Television Championship, a title which he won at the final heat back in 2015 by leaping from the top of a steel cage onto the bear, ruthless Ryan Davidson, the current Reality Wrestling Champion. The same man that he later on beat again for the Reality Wrestling Championship. Brian Keith fights for not only himself, but for his family. A proud father of young girls who look up to their dad, who go through it with their dad. Q fights for nobody but himself. Selfish, arrogant. But they're both fighting for the same thing at the end of the day, and that is the Reality of Wrestling Television Championship, an opportunity at that illustrious title. Let's not forget if you look back in the annals and time of professional wrestling, that television championship has been one of the crowning jewels for a man in his career. After Booker T had a successful run as a part of a tag team with Harlem Heat, the first singles championship that he ever wore. One of the things about working at Reality of Wrestling is you have at least seen your competitor before when you've been a veteran in this locker room for going on a decade. These two have met each other once upon a time. They are not strangers to one another, but really their paths always in reality of wrestling have been parallel. Tonight, they're perpendicular. Tonight, one has to beat the other in order to get what they want. They are on the same journey with the same prize in mind. Oh, oh. Brian Keith working on that arm with the Mysterious Q and Mysterious Q. Upper forearm, almost an elbow to the face of Brian Keith, and then proclaiming, that's right. Oh, fastest kicks in the south, though. When you got those, you're always in the ball game. Spinning back fist misses from Q. Over for a double axe handle there. Misses from Q again. Kick to the midsection. Brian Keith maybe using a little bit too much time there. Absolutely did. Q going for a drop kick. Brian Keith had it scout. Oh! Beautiful drop kick there, sending Brian Key to the outside. Veteran-like maneuver coming out in front of the commentary table, trying to get his wits about him. But Q looking to fly. No. Q going under the bottom rope. Brian Keith. Oh, beautiful drop. This is the kind of action you see when two veterans who know one another get in there and start mixing it up. Brian Keith rolling Q back to the inside. Cover one, two, and a kick out from the former champion.
Brian Keith getting back into this thing. That shin across the face of Q. And although Brian Keith did have a very good 2020 for the first half, the back nine, however, has not been the best treatment for Brian Keith. He found himself being the Reality Wrestling Champion, teaming with G.I. Bro earlier this year, to then losing his championship, and not even really being back in the main event picture since. Cover one, two, that vicious, vicious drop kick to Brian Keith's head. Brian Keith was suffering from trauma in his Reality Wrestling Championship rematch with Ryan Davidson. Just an exchange right there, back and forth. Buster from Q, cover one, two, almost had him right there. Wow. Q is like any good predator, picking apart the body of his prey before he fully dissects them and ingests them. Wrapping those massive legs and just great vining the neck of the Lone Ranger and then looking around at the audience in complete disdain and dismay. Q is on a cover one, two. Q is on a mission, a mission to prove to the reality of wrestling faithful and to the professional wrestling world around, taking off the wrist tape right now that he is one of the preeminent stars in this industry. Big chop to the chest. Mm. Now European style uppercut sending down Brian Keith. Hughes got him in the corner. Putting him up on the top turnbuckle there. You gotta wonder what is Q thinking? The only high risk maneuver he really likes to do is either a missile drop kick or that 455 off the top rope. So maybe he's thinking about a superplex here. We're about to find out. As you see the wear on the face of Brian Keith after taking all this offense from the franchise. And now second rope. Q, top rope Keith. Going for a superplex, but wait a minute. An inverted rodeo DDT from Brian Keith. Almost a scorpion death drop from the top rope to Mysterious Q. Whether it was purposeful, whether it was by accident, whether it was through osmosis, Brian Keith has found his way back into this match. Both men are down. The winner will go on to face. Edge Stone and two other men in that fatal four-way match for the Reality of Wrestling Television Championship at Christmas Chaos. Stakes cannot get any higher than they are right now. Which man will get back to a vertical base? No doubt they will have the advantage, and it looks like it's Brian Keith by somehow, some way, like Rocky Balboa using those ropes to climb back up to two feet. Oh, and catching Q off guard with a right foot to the face. Ducks under the line, and a big lariat from the Cowboy. Going for that side effect. Q battling out of it. Pinning predicament. One, two, kick out after two. Oh, there it is. Cover one, two. Cowboy! 
he's lassoing him up. This could be all. Kick to the gut. Rodeo! DDT! Q able to jump out of it. Isaac Bouillon getting bumped there from Brian Keith. Oh my goodness! Mysterious Q with a Q cutter to the family jewels. And there's a proper Q cutter to the Lone Ranger of the row. Former champion, one, two, three. Q is going to Christmas chaos. Mysterious Q will go on. They have one more opportunity at Edge Stone for that television title, but what two men will join him? We're gonna find out But the Q advances, and it's gonna be a happy Merry Christmas for you.